Ladies and gentlemen, I hope everybody is sitting down right now. I hope everyone has taken a massive breath because today we're about to unbox another TCA Gaming Pokemon Mystery Box. And if you don't know who TCA Gaming is, if you're like, Ando, what the heck is this? Basically, TCA is the biggest Pokemon eBay store on the internet. I'll link his eBay store down below if you want to go check it out. He also sells a couple of these mystery boxes, but like limited amounts because they always sell out. But he sent us this mystery box today, right? I paid for it, but then he said, Ando, I'm not going to tell you what's inside, but I'm going to give you a hint. All I'm going to say is I've tried to include more products that contain or lead to a Charizard. What the flip does he mean by that? Like, there are so many products that have a Charizard inside that could... Oh, okay, 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 I straight off the bat we see what he's talking about. Check, okay, you guys are gonna freak out. This might actually be a Charizard mystery box. He didn't say it was, but like, a lot of products that... Oh my gosh! Yo, check this out! What the... Okay, look at this, straight off the bat. It's a Charizard EX red and blue collection. It's a little, like, ripped and beat up, so maybe we open it up. But it's the Charizard EX red and blue collection box. I'm pretty sure these, um, these actually gone up a little bit in price because it's the 20th anniversary product. This is actually hectic as because we get the full art Charizard as well and the figurine. So, the Charizard EX box. Okay, this is officially the Charizard box for sure. Then we've got, look at this. This is so sick. Burning Shadows Elite Trainer Box. I was literally looking at buying one of these recently because you have a higher chance of pulling the Rainbow Rare Charizard out of an ETB. Um, but I've also got a booster box on the way of Burning Shadows as well. So maybe we do a duo opening and try to get the Rainbow Red. I know you guys love that card to pieces. The Rainbow Red Charizard out of Burning Shadows. And we'll open up an entire booster box and ETB in a video. But that is fantastic. Yo, this is all like Charizard products. I did not realize, man. Okay. ETB to the side. Then we've got... <laughs> this This is ridiculous. Evolutions completely sealed up. Oh, um, booster box right here. This is my second evolution booster box I've got sealed up. So I'm thinking maybe, just maybe, we open one of them up on the channel. You guys still love that set, and I know you guys always tell me about it. Like, Ando, you gotta crack open a uh, Evolutions ETB. It's the absolute jam. So maybe we do. It's pretty sick. It's um, yeah, it's all completely sealed though. No way. What the flip, man? He sent me another. Unbroken Bonds Mini Portfolio. Are you <laughs> Okay, but I officially know what's inside of these right now. So this is like an Unbroken Bonds Portfolio Booster Box. It's my second one. I didn't even open the first one up, but it's got a bunch of these inside of it. It's got 12. It's got 12 of those, which have one Mini Binder and one Boost back inside. Should I just open one of these for a meme and just see what the pool's like if you opened a Booster Box worth of Portfolio Cases? Yo, okay. This actually, he, yo, he was not kidding when he said he tried to slim it down a lot more because he sent us those bulk products, then that's it. The rest is all PSA or like, it could be booster packs because that's what happened last time. But that's it for the Charizard Seal products. This is random ads. I am very, very curious what's inside of here. So let's start opening up these bad boys. Man, and oh, this is not a P yo, this is not a PSA card, 100%. This is like maybe a booster. It feels super. Th oh, okay. Let's all let's all just stay calm for a second because let me just tell you right now, there's a lot of rare sets that lead to a Charizard, and if that's what he's trying to say, that he concentrated more on the absolute rare stuff that you guys would love. Okay, okay, he's not even wrong. Oh, I love the fact this is a Charizard box. Unweighed first edition Team Rocket Booster Pack right there. Hot DD Daffodils, that's crazy. First edition too, man. I've got so many. This man's been like hooking me up with so many of these vintage boosters and it's unweighed. Alright, first edition Team Rocket, but let's keep it going. It does not stop. Look at this, it's not even a uh it's not even a PSA. This is a bit it's too flimsy to be a PSA card. Oh! 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 You're gonna kill me, man! You're literally gonna kill me! I did not know these even existed! A square cut! Base sets Mewtwo! Oh my gosh, I'm nervous to even touch it. I don't want to get it out of its um, thing. This is a base set Mewtwo that's been cut wrong. It's an error. 
but they cut it so wrong it turned out to be a square. Oh my, this is going to be fantastic for my collection. Oh my gosh, they proper cut it like a square. Why'd they do that? Did someone get the scissors out of Wizards of the Coast back in the day? I mean, if you guys probably either get really excited like me over this, or you think an Ando, it's, it's a square cut Pokemon card. I don't know. For it to be base set, and I know it's legit because it came from TCA, like, he doesn't give anything fake. That is just, that's a gem piece. It's kind of like all the other stuff that he gave me. Fantastic, man. I love that. Yo, today's mystery box has been quality items. Alright, so, so far, a base set miscut era square Mewtwo card. Then a first edition Team Rocket, and now we get another one. This one I'm going to say is a PSA card. It feels a lot more like rigid on the sides. Oh, what the? <laughs> Yo! Oh, no! Alright, I'm out of here. Goodbye, YouTube. Holy smokes! Oh, my God! 2006 Pokemon Gold Star Mewtwo from EX Holland Phantoms. 9 out of 10 condition. This, this could actually be the best mystery box I've done on the channel. Like, we've done some crazy ones, and we got, yeah, we got the base set booster box, that's crazy. But for a condensed little box of just gems? The shake is so real. Golden Star Mewtwo. What do we even do? 9 out of 10. I'm putting that to the side, but I don't want it. Because I could look at that all day. I rarely even just have gold stars in my collection, let alone a 9 out of 10 PSA card. Think about the stuff we got so far. First edition booster, square cut base set hollow, and a gold star. This, guys, this isn't even a PSA again. This is just, um, this is just a booster or it's something else. I don't, I don't really want to know. It's another one! Oh, stop the press! It's just another first edition Team Rock booster. No big deal right there. Jesse and James are hand-drawn artwork. Far out. Yo, what the heck, man? Another first edition Team Rocket Wizard of the Coast black booster right there. And we have three more. This one is heavy as. Why? Why is this one heavy? You know what? Let's do the heavy one. I probably should have waited till last to do this one, but I don't care. We're gonna open it up right now. What the flip? No way, no way. Oh! Oh my gosh! You are kidding me! Ladies and gentlemen, we have our first ever Hidden Fates PSA return cards, and it's a Gem Mid 10 Rainbow Rare Birds and a Gem Mid 10 Birds. Full art. Excuse me while I go pass out in a dumpster for 10 minutes. I was thinking about getting P uh, Hidden Fates graded soon. I'm like, I could, I, we should get them graded. That sounds like a reasonable idea. Nah, he's just gonna send me the gem mint versions of the birds. This has made my week so much better after like... Oh my gosh, guys. This could be the best mystery box we've done. I'm gonna keep saying that, but... Hidden Fates, two returns, both of them gem mints. I just already want to do the recap. Okay, this one's got a lot of air inside. It feels like it needed to be padded, but it also feels like it's not a PSA card. Oh my gosh, I should have guessed it. If it's not one, it's a first edition Team Rocket Booster, everyone. Look at that. <laughs> It's got all of the artworks in the front. I'm done. I'm literally done. We have one more thing to go. What's in this one? This one, it's a PSA, but it feels like it's just one PSA card. Okay, you ready? Three, two, one. Oh my gosh! It's a Unified Minds full art. The one that I've been looking for. It's literally the full art in Gem Mint Tag Team Mew and Mew 2 Gem Mint Unified Minds card right there. Okay, alright, stop the press. Stop the press. Oh my gosh! The selection of PSA cards you've included, man! Yo, this is amazing. Is anyone else like dead? That's honestly crazy. Two hidden fates. Awesome banging Unified Minds. Gold Star Mewtwo. But then, like, don't even give it the square cut Mewtwo. That's just... The, oh. And I keep forgetting, like, we, we opened Silk products, like, a couple minutes ago. I mean, okay. We've definitely got more, uh, Burning Shadows to come. Like, we're gonna do an unboxing of that. We have to do, um, maybe Evolutions. I've got my Charizard EX Silk box as well. And I'm thinking, like, with all these, uh, first edition Team Rocket boosters, we're gonna do, like, a Team Rocket boost back opening too. We've got three first edition boosters. Let me know if you like those more condensed, just pure gem openings. I've lost my voice, and we only recorded for, like, I don't know. Well, it was definitely wasn't as long as usual, but, like, everything he did was just amazing. I... 
I'm lost for words. That was legendary. Let's do a recap. So guys, I reckon this is probably one of the smaller yet more epic recaps we've done on a TCA Gaming mystery box. Every single item here is an absolute slapper, whether it relates to a Charizard or whether it's a Hidden Fates PSA Gem Mint 10, I don't care, they're all amazing. So let's start off here with this Pokemon Generations Red and Blue Charizard exclusive box. With the figurine, the full art card and the boosters, yeah, it's damaged, but look, I think if it's damaged, that kind of low-key means we might have to open it up on the channel. But what do you guys reckon? I think this is fantastic. So, we got the Charizard EX box. Then we've got an Evolutions completely sealed booster box. These are not only gone up in price, they keep will because it's like a reprint of the base set. They'll always be going up. But I've got two of them now. Do I open this up on the channel? Would you guys watch an Evolutions booster box opening? Now, something I'm definitely opening up on the channel is this Burning Shadows ETB with the Burning Shadows booster box I recently ordered as well. How cool is this? It's got a uh, really high chance of pulling that Rainbow Rare Charizard everyone wants out the set. And speaking of a Rainbow Rare Charizard everyone wants, this one right here. The Portfolio Booster Box Completely Sealed Box right here. This product we actually featured on the last, I think it was the last mystery box we did with TCA, but basically this is what they give to stores to sell those mini portfolios with booster pack and a portfolio. This is like a really small item, but yeah, it's a box sealed full of them, and I'm guessing the pull rates must be alright. So if this is our second one, lads, are we opening this bad boy too? Maybe we do like a Charizard day where we just open all this stuff for Charizard. Anyway, so we got that too. Then this is just, I I don't even know, I have like any words for it. We have a square cut base set Hollow Mewtwo. A Mewtwo Hollow by itself would have been, you know what, that's fantastic. But then we get to the square cut, oh my gosh, it's amazing. Who would have thought someone cut this thing as a square? I don't even know. Then we get our first edition, Team Rocket. You can't go wrong with Team Rocket. Like, you know what, any Wizard of the Coast booster, you're not going to go wrong. Let alone, give me a first edition banger. That's crazy. Then we've got my PSA cards. This is so sick. Started off here with that Unified Minds Gem Mint 10 Full Up Mew Mew 2. Unreal. Then we've got Gold Star Mew 2 9 out of 10. Bro, I don't even know what to say other than thank you so much. And to finish it off, two Gem Mint cards. That's cool by itself, let alone the brand new rarest set out at the moment, Hidden Fates. You are kidding me. Oh, I'm so done. Anyway, hopefully you guys enjoyed this crazy... Come on, focus. There we go. Hopefully you enjoyed this crazy-ass mystery box. Pikachu, are you as dead as me? Hopefully you are. <laughs> Demolish the like button if you want to see more of those on the channel. Thank you so much, TCL. I'll link you down below in the description if you guys want to check out any of his uh, eBay Pokemon products, his mystery boxes. This, though, oh, this made my whole year. How cool was every product, man?